both running into the shot now. Oh gosh, this is engaging. Hello, I'm Plumpy from WhatCulture.com. I'm joined by other Adam from WhatCulture.com. Oh, don't start. Don't I'm sorry. Start. I'm sorry. Okay. I know I, you don't like your, t- your sides being sides. Touched. Yeah, I've got a real problem with that. Oh, it's a childhood thing. Wasn't no, it? no, no. It's uh, well, I guess so. Yeah, at school, you know, when people will come up behind you, are you turning into Jack, go, turning, oh, telling like your that. stories and about your horrible. school days. All right, don't. Uh, Jack no, we're has, doing it again. We're oh, starting again. Start I'm not again. being All compared right. to Jack. All right, sorry about that. Absolutely okay. not. Let's do it. Oh, <laughs> oh, he's 28 years old. Welcome to Questions You Most Want Answered. Jack has refused to do it, so instead we've got two legends instead. Hit the music. <laughs> Axel McGooch, or McGooch, I'm not sure, asks, who do you think... Kurt Angle was on the phone to. I think it was... Okay, I, I, what I'm hoping it is and what I think it is, Go on. I think it's Steph. Yeah. But I'm hoping that they go a bit more swervy with it I'm hoping it's an illegitimate son, someone who could who? be on the roster. Chad Gable. No. No. Maybe. Oh. Mm. It's a bit too cute, isn't it? Um, Shelton Benjamin. No. <laughs> <laughs> Who um, looks like him? Nobody. Nobody. Nobody looks like him. It's not. Please, it's, please tell me it's not Enzo. Oh no! No, it won't be. Who no. Do, who do you think it would be? I think if it's oh, anyone, I think it would be Corey. I've heard rumours. It might be not rumours, but like in terms of like timeline syncing up, Noam Dar might make sense. There was Little the, Scottish kid. Well, he's the youngest. They've made a point of him being the youngest person on the roster. Oh yeah. What an odd pairing. I'll tell you who it isn't, 100%, and that is Dixie Carter. It's not Dixie Carter. It's not. And I know she's been uh, in the Kurt Angle documentary this week, but they're not going to put eyes on a competitor's product. It's just that simple. It's it's not Dixie. I think... People are suggesting maybe it's a gay lover. I don't think that Kurt would go for that, personally, just because he's quite a religious family man. So I just don't see it being something he's comfortable with. I think it's just his mum and she's been hassling him for tickets to Raw, and he's finally going to bring her in front row and she's going to get to see Raw. But it could ruin his career because he's been a bit cheeky asking for front row tickets. That's right. They don't like that in no. WWE. That's my guess. Plonking, you can bang plonking on the it. Rock's mum on the front row every <laughs> single week, even when he's not around. I think you're right. I think it's going to be Steph. Which is disappointing because I don't want to see Angle versus Trips at SummerSlam. Doesn't or matter what ever. you want. It doesn't matter. No, it doesn't. That's the match. Next question. That's the match. Andy Ramos asks, Mm -hmm. of all of the current WWE tag teams, who would you most like to see feature at WrestleMania? Well, like, feature, like, really heavily. Um, Uh, Have a match at WrestleMania, I guess is the question. And let's say it's for the titles. Okay, let's Jack makes up these rules as well, doesn't he? Okay, sure. Okay, 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 yeah, yeah, sure. Um, They've just broken them up, but I really want to see um, Revival versus DIY. On, That's a good on the show. big stage. Maybe it's something that could happen again in a few more years, but... Uh, okay, if, the, if we can't have that, I would like to see... I know what you're going to say. I bet you want to take my answer here. American Alpha versus Revival. That was going to be my answer, yeah. Knew Raw it. versus SmackDown. Yeah, makes sense. WrestleMania. Yeah. If I not, I would have pitted you more as a Revival versus the Hardys kind of guy. Yes. Uh, they're just about to do that, though. Yeah, they are. Let's ignore that. No, let's not. No. Okay. Two brilliant teams. Alpha, Revival. Vince, if you're watching, please subscribe. Please do subscribe to What Culture Extra. Click an ad. Michael Allen, Mickey Allen, asks, who is the breakout star of 2017? Um, I, in much the same way that 2015 was Seth Rollins, 2016 was AJ Styles, 2017, Samoa Joe, I think. If they continue uh-uh. as he's been going, I think Samoa Joe. I think this will be close. his year. You're Go close. On. It's Cody Rhodes. Oh, Absolutely that's a very Cody good. Rhodes. And I know it's WWE questions you might most want to answer, but it's Cody, isn't it? He's done the most. He's done brilliantly. Skirls up there as well. Yeah. WWE, you're right. Actually, you're know right. what? No. Jericho? Um, no, no. Incredible Considering year? that Wrestle Not Kingdom, breakout. Wrestle Kingdom, you know, happened this year by a few days. Um, Kenny yeah, Omega. Omega, that's a good shout. It's Kenny but he's Omega. He's not WWE. No, you're right. So, so who is it? Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe. Fine. Fucking hell. Enrico forty eight, the forty eighth of the Enricos, asked. That's, that's, f- f- that's <laughs> fucking shit. <laughs> Do you think SmackDown should get an extra twenty minutes? Hi, hungry. I'm Dad. Sorry, what? 
no fluidity. No, there's no point. Not in these videos. That's not what they subscribe for. Not for questions you want to answer. Tell us a story. Should, should Smackdown. Tell should us a Smackdown, story. Should Smackdown. Should Smackdown. What get about extra Adam and the Gants? Tell us another should story Smackdown about them. Should Smackdown get an extra 20 minutes? No. Oh, sorry, no. No. Fine. What? Done. Get an extra 20 minutes? No, it's fine. Two hours. Lovely. Two, what? Smackdown oh, should be two God, hours this and was twenty to be a quick minutes. One. It was. It's a one. What are you talking you, about? You, you wanked it. Did you make up that question? No. Enrico forty eight. What good guy? The forty eighth of the Enricos. <laughs> <laughs> Next question. <laughs> Fucking hell. Brandon X, the right? Tenth of the Brandons, Roman numerals. <laughs> uh-huh. uh, asked if your phone went off in public. You got a wrestling theme as a ringtone, which is the most embarrassing that it could be. Oh shit. I'm it. gonna go. Spirit Squad, because it would just be men randomly <laughs> shouting. Mickey! And, Mikey! <laughs> it would just be weird. Uh, the Brood, maybe? That would be <sighs> Ricky Rips. <sighs> 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 in a sales meeting. <laughs> Stop. Sorry. Sorry, Michael. Uh, I'll just turn that off. Uh, I'm an arse man. <laughs> arse man. How about uh, William Regal? He's a man! And finally, Ryan McGuinness asks, why does Simon, you know, the, the, the chap, yeah. Uh, yeah, with, uh, he does the why videos every, every day, mm -hmm. uh, why does he never feature in videos with the rest of you? He does, all the time. I mean, he's uh, over on the gaming, hang on, he's in the office right now, I'll go and get him. Simon, Simon, mate, I found him. There he is, go and sit next to, it's Simon. It's not. Hello, mate. Simon's massive. I'm bigger than that. He's got a beard. All right. Simon doesn't have a beard. Exactly. That's what he grew a beard, and suddenly everyone's like, where's Simon? He's over on the gaming channel. He's in London. He's Twitch culture champion. He's, it's very important. Look at him. He's shrunk in recent, since coming off the, you know, but like, he's, whoa, what's, oh, sorry, tough, tough subject, but. Thanks very there much for is. tuning in to WW Questions You Most Want Answered, featuring Plumpy. It's really fun, isn't it? You, Simon you do this Miller. a lot, don't you? Oh, it's so soft, it moves. Simon Miller <laughs> and me, Adam Pacitti. Cool. Um, we've got to go. It? Good luck. We've got to. You want to go? Why? <laughs> Why? Why oh, do you want to yeah. go? Yeah. Can I, can I go say, do, the, do the head slap. Do the head This is workplace so bullying. I'm, I'm, <laughs> this is horrible. I'm Simon from WhatCulture.com. I'm Simon from WhatCulture. And thanks for watching. No, no. I'm off the juice. Uh, no. <laughs> Why? 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 Why Here's... should something happen? Here's why. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. See you next oh, week. That really hurt. <laughs> we your pie holes, you dirty, sweaty marks. You think you're a smart mark, do you? A smart, is it? Then answer me this simple, rattling question. <laughs> from which African country was Kamala Builders coming from? No, you're wrong, because you are a sweaty mark. The answer is Uganda. Improve your knowledge and test your bastard self with the new What Culture Wrestling trivia game, available now at shop.whatculture.com. Sweaty mark.